and it exploded like the Big Bang. Oh yeah. This is the answer. Is <laughs> and what is the song? Like the universe is blue. Like the universe. The universe is blue. Like Andrew was born in New York City. He came in at about six and a half pounds in the cold month of February. He always enjoys playing with his brother. Oh, good. Like his daddy, he always right. loves spaghetti. He enjoys riding the subway train. Enjoys dancing with grandpa. Enjoys flying on a plane. Here we were flying from New York City to Dallas, Texas to visit some family and friends. Bye bye, bye plane. Besides having a learning disability, dyslexia, he was a top performer in both his preschool and first couple years in elementary school. Like, you have a little like penny board type. Yeah. And, and we have enjoying the learning to skateboard yeah. with his dad. All right. Okay, Andrew, which one do you want to try? This. You want to try that one? Mm -hmm. Okay, so start practicing. You got to balance one foot and then kick with the other foot. Do you want to go home or do you want to keep going? Keep going. All right, give me five. Give me five. Give me five. Enjoy scooting with his dad and his brother. Scooting through the woods. Enjoys painting. Does this work? There you go. Put your foot on the pedal. Turn the key. And he's driving a car. Andrew was always a happy boy. Andrew always had developmental delays, like speech and a lack of interest in eating and drinking, but in 2019 he developed unusual OCD behavior. Okay. 
September 2019, Andrew started developing an extreme neurological disorder. Andrew, why are you walking funny? What's wrong with your leg? Andrew started losing control of his motor skills and ability to walk What happened to your leg? Anxiety, filling up every space, no privacy. And silently, you okay? can build and build until you finally see. Huh? Whoa, it's taking over. Damn, no closure, moving closer. No exposure, I just wanna be a loner. Uh, some can't stay sober, looking over all their shoulders. Like moving boulders just to get out of the home. It sucks, I've had enough. Andrew had started developing extreme obsessive compulsive disorder and anxiety attack. Okay. He started losing the ability to communicate and had odd confused behaviors. Breakdowns became frequent, developed extreme obsessive compulsive disorder and anxiety attacks. October 2019, Andrew wanted to learn to ride a bike. Andrew, what are you doing? You want to ride it? The OCD you? had become extreme. Andrew started losing control of his body. What are you trying to do? I got nightmares in my head. I fear the thoughts build up until I can't hear that my mind fills up into a creature. Andrew had lost his ability to communicate and socialize at the playground. Anxiety filling up every space, no privacy. Andrew even started getting bullied. Whoa, it's taking over. Damn, no closure, moving closer. No exposure, I just wanna be a loner. Uh, some can't stay sober, looking over all their shoulders. Like moving boulders just to Breakdowns became everyday frequent for hours. I don't wanna Eat it? feel the stuck under the rug. All my problems that I shove. I got okay. nightmares in my head. I feel Andrew became huh? mostly non verbal. That my mind fills Andrew, what are you doing? To a creature, and it haunts me so you gonna ride it? You get on and daddy will just walk you. Like this. You can ride and I'm gonna hold you. <laughs> okay, you can go on the line. <laughs> the OCD get your rabbit. would keep him from being able to learn okay, to ride the, line? the bike. Is this the line? Okay, we're on the line. Okay. Let's go to There you go. I got build up until I can't hear Towards the end of 2019, Andrew's anxiety attacks got worse. much deeper. I got Here's an anxiety attack where he started scratching his face and had a hard time breathing. And even though it was freezing outside, he threw off his coat. And are you saying breathe or play? Which one? You want to breathe? Yeah, he's saying breathe. Well, Dan, do you want to put your coat back on? Here you can see he's losing the ability to swallow and started building a mucus in his mouth. Sometimes it could be a little tough. I just need to feel like the ends inside for me. But let's be really, really anxiety. And neurologist recommended going to the hospital for neurology and to see a brain surgeon. In January 2020, Andrew was brought to New York City Children's Hospital. Look, it's a popsicle. Andrew had lost a lot of his Here weight. At 10, he only weighed Look. about 40 pounds. MRI found evidence of previous brain inflammation in a six millimeter cyst in the penile gland of the brain. Here are the findings from the brain surgeon. There was evidence of previous inflammation in the brain from a possible unknown infection. Brain surgeon and neurologists believe Andrew's issues could stem from the cyst, autism, or previous mysterious infection in the brain, or both. The brain surgeon believes Andrew would not survive a cyst removal. We 
are unable to get definitive, definitive answers for the cause and symptoms or treatment for what Andrew had. We, I, would not give up on my son. We were prescribed risperidone and antipsychotic, and this only made the symptoms worse. We had heard good things about this medication Zoloft, so we requested to try that. So we tried Sertaline, or Zoloft, an SSRI, Selective Serotonin Reuptic Inhibitor. We have found some success with Zoloft medication and with physical therapy. Zoloft has not cured Andrew, but it has helped with his symptoms. Andrew started eating and jumping around again. Physical therapy and exercise has also helped. Where did Andrew go? There he is. There he is. How does Andrew feel today? Good. You feel good? Good. Andrew started making art again. Searching for greatness in a sea of the dying and shame. We will learn to ride a bike and do other things. First, we must work on our physical fitness and motor skills. Good, Andrew. So I had Andrew run around with a soccer ball and ran with him and kicked it back and forth to each other. We did this almost every day for months to get back in shape. Okay, Andrew. Did that go your hand? Did go your shirt? Put your hands down. That's it. That's it. Nice. There you go. And a couple years later, we try again riding the bike. Never underestimate the power of one's will to do something, to succeed. Down the hill, ready? Okay, go. Pedal. Yes, pedal, Andrew, go. You got it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Put your feet on the pedal. Go ahead. Pedal. Pedal, step Andrew. Step by step. Day by day. Put your feet on the pedal. With patience, hard work, and determination. Thank you. Yeah, I just want to be great. 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 Good job, man. Good job, keep going. Will a strong determination that allows one like to do that something way? difficult. Okay, you want to do it again? Okay, go. Went good. Keep going. This is a statement to appreciate all that is vacant. It's just for the taking. If you make up your mind, you can take it. I'm going to be complacent. I would work in a mission of this big Good, Andrew. <laughs> and with time and a lot of patience and determination, Andrew was able to learn to ride the bike. Nice ride. Slow down a little bit. Slow down. Never underestimate the power of one's will to succeed. Learn to ride the bike. Good. Good riding. Yeah, Keep going. Keep going, Andrew. Keep going. Here he goes. First time biking. Good. Have fun. Yeah. Keep believing in yourself.
Yeah, this is Cobra. Oh, that's school bus? Wow. They, they, they do go to school. Oh, they do. Yeah. The universe is blue. Like, the universe is blue? The universe is blue? I like yeah. the blue line. What makes the universe blue? The blue line. The blue line? And then, then, then the Osaka Museum explodes like the Big Bang. Oh, wow. And then what happens? And what happens after that? Then, then, mm -hmm. then, then there's no universe. Then there's no universe? And then what is it? If there's no universe, what is it then? Space. Space? It's open space? So it's just open space. Mm -hmm. And then is there a Big Bang again? And then it makes stars again? It does, it makes stars again? Yellow stars, yellow stars. Yellow stars? Oh. And then the yellow stars make other things? Matter and planets and stuff? Maybe? And then it makes us? And is that what we are? What are we? What are we? Yeah, what are we? Where do we come from? The universe. Oh, we come from the universe. So we are... Like the sun? Yeah, like the sun. The sun is red and yellow and orange, right? You like the rainbow? You like the rainbow, yeah. You like the rainbow? Yeah. We are part of the stars and part of the planets. We're part of all the chemistry of the universe. Put together, right? I know, thank you. Thank you for telling me. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you for all that information, Andrew. That's very good. Talking a lot. You're doing a great job.